welcome back to my channel. So today we're going to unbox what's called Goddess Provisions. It is um, a box that I've been trying lately. It does have a lot of like spiritual or just like incense and candles and I don't know what category you want to put it under to be honest with you. I have always been a spiritualist so that's what I call it but um Last time in this box I got like Zodiac socks and it was really cool so I can't wait to see what this month has to offer. Unfortunately I don't know the, the like the theme or anything. Maybe it has a card in there it'll tell me. It does cost like, I don't even know how much I pay to be honest, like $30, $35 a month I think, somewhere around there. But it is jam packed with a lot of really great stuff. So I don't mind paying a little bit more. So let's dive on in and see what we have this month. Um, if I didn't tell you, it's Goddess Provisions. Uh, but I do enjoy it. It is upside down. Of course, my, on the other side of the box has my mailer. So just give me a hot second. Oh, I can flip it and open it up for you. So this is what the inside of the box looks like this month. And it looks so interesting. So let's see what's... Oh, this is rune stones. So right away, the first bag I pulled out is got a little bag of runes, like rune coins in here. I have never had rune coins, so that's going to be really cool to have. So that's the first item in the bag is some runes. Oh, it's a little canvas bag. There should be paperwork in here. I haven't gotten that far, I guess. So this little bag, it looks like it says Goddess Provisions. It looks like it's just a small little canvas bag, which I do like getting. And then there's something in bubble wrap um, that I pulled out. It looks like it's got a chain, so I'm hoping this is a piece of jewelry of some kind. Let's just get into it and find out. So, yeah. I have no idea what kind of it is yet. It does definitely, like, have this... I think this is one of those things like you could hang in the car. It doesn't really look like something you could hang on yourself. But I do like the little moon clip on the end. And this has like a crystal in the center of here. As well as a quartz on the bottom. So that's kind of interesting. I like that. I can't wait to find the little thing to tell me what it technically is. But that's neat. Back in a little bag. Let's we'll stick it off to the side. Next item that I see down here. Ooh, it's in a little bag, and it looks like it might be like oil or perfume. It says Seraph Awakening Your Divine Wisdom on it, and it does look like it is a kind of perfume. So. Oh, it's really nice and earthy and a little bit of scent of, it says it has rose and, uh, which is alcohol, essential oil blend. So it's not really descriptive of what kind of oils, maybe the paperwork will have it. I think it's on down, so we'll stick that over here. Oh, I've got a little far too far to be seen. Now, there's this box, so we'll pull this aside, we'll get out the paperwork, and let's move this box for right now. So here is the rune guide. This will help you with your runes that you got in the beginning, so we'll put that back in with your little runes. Go ahead and put everything over here. Um, this looks like it's a CD of some kind. 
says positively magic on the back. Oh, positively mystic. I don't really want to hurt that. I kind of want that all in one thing. So let me tear around it real quick. So it's a wooden board, and it's got yes and no, and it's got unsure, and so what it is, it's like more like a scrying tool. So it's a pendulum, and the way it works is, is that you ask it a question, and you hold it by the moon, and then it will go one way or the other. Like, if you ask if you're going to get... Yeah, that's what that means. It's so awesome. I mean, I love them. But, um... I didn't know that. So... So that's the pendulum board. And this is the clear quartz pendulum that goes with it. So, that is neat. I should have known that, but... I wasn't thinking. So, let's put the pendulum away put the pendulum board back in here and then this is my information booklet so we're gonna hold it off for a minute and then we're gonna see what this is real quick so the last item in my box oh let's hope this is all in one piece and good Yes, it's a saucer and teacup for the person who drinks so much tea like me. And it's so pretty. Check that out. It's got the moon phases on the inside. Oh, I love it. I love it. So, um, let's put this back together. I don't want it broke. So, all together, I got a teacup and a saucer and some runes and the pendulum board and the perfume. And that's my box. Now, if this looks interesting to you or it looks like something fun that would be something you'd be interested in, all my links are in the description. I do pay for every box by myself. And let's see if this tells me. Myrrh, ginger, sandalwood, sweet orange, and geranium. It says, it also has gemstone incense. So, the teacup is a $33 value. The perfume is a $20 value. Volume, yes, I have volume. No, value. The rooms were a $22 value. Um, the board for the crystal is a $22 value. And the quartz pendulum is a $22 value. And then you get a digital bonus this month. And your digital bonus says introduction to magic. Explore what magic is and how to use it. So you just go on. It's a $3 value. It looks like it's a, um, like an online exercise. Seven of them for you to try. And that is my goddess provisions for this month. So like I said, this guys looks good to you. Is this something you want to try? All my links are in the description. Any of those links will help me out. So if all else fails and you want to contribute to my channel, just click the links because that does sometimes, depending on which box it is, gives me a little something. Not much, but a little bit. And as always, I heart your face and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.